she's pregnant. She, yeah, she, yeah, she's uh, Oh, that was Bobby Jean. That was Bobby Jean. Oh, sorry, yeah, no, yeah, George Jean was 24, and it was 32. of the castle's 10-year restoration and it's a real privilege for all of us to be here in these one, this wonderful setting and in the company of many of the people who worked on, supported and funded this incredible project. So let's just once again show our appreciation for all the people who've made today possible. <laughs> Let me introduce you to someone who knows the entire story of this particular site person who was here and involved from the very beginning. Ladies and gentlemen, can you give a very big, warm Lincolnshire welcome to Councillor Martin Hill! Thank you, Colin. It's not often I get a, a, an introduction like that. I think I'll hire you uh, on a permanent basis. For 947 years, Lincoln Castle has stood at the very heart of our historic city. And over the past decade, Lincolnshire County Council and its partners have been working hard to give this Lincoln landmark a new lease of life. Alongside the investment by the County Council, money has come from the Heritage Lottery Fund, the European Regional Development Fund, the David Ross Foundation, the Garfield Western Foundation, and other private donations. For the last 10 years, Mary Powell has led our project team, marshalling her own army of skilled specialists to bring the story of Lincoln, Lincoln Castle to life like never before. I'm sure many of you would have met Mary in person over that time and experienced firsthand her passion for the subject. applause for Her Royal Highness, ladies and gentlemen. That's it, make sure you get your selfies.